Hello everyone, hope all is well today. My name is Gilles Lamotte and today we'll be discussing the use of an R editor window to submit R commands at the R prompt. And so we know that we can enter commands at the prompt to get R to do things for us. So for example, let's say that I want to create a numerical variable called W. I will use the equal sign to assign and then a function called C to combine numbers together. And so here, for example, let's say I have 12, 13, 56, 23, and so on. So I entered a few numerical variables, uh, sorry, a few numerical values. And then as I enter the command, this will create a numerical variable called w. And, and I can obtain some summary statistics for this numerical vector by using the summary function w. Now, here we entered commands at the prompt. Alternatively, what we could do is open an editor window. So if you go to the R GUI, and there we'll see a, a menu, go to File, and then I'll want to open a new script if I'm using a Windows machine, or on a Mac, this is going to be called New Document. And so I open a new document or a new script window. And then here we will enter our commands. Uh, the advantage of using an editor window is that sometimes our commands are a bit long, actually longer than a line, and so we can actually enter the whole command and then submit it to the, the prompt. Um, so here, let's say that I want to write a, command, a comment, sorry, that um, y is a numerical variable. And then I will construct y by using the C function with the equal sign to assign values to Y. And so here I'll enter some values, so 12, 34, 22, 22, 25, 112, 34, 21. And so we have our command. And recall that we constructed a vector called W. And so here, maybe I want a descriptive, or not a descriptive, but a comparative box plot of W against Y. And so I'll have box plot of W for the first sample, and then Y for the second sample. So now I have three commands in my editor window. To submit them to the prompt, what we will do is use either our mouse to select the commands or we could use our keyboard with the arrow keys and then once we have selected our commands we will use control R so I will enter control R because I'm in a Windows machine or this will be command enter on a Mac and so as I use control R on Windows or command enter on a Mac, this will submit the commands that we selected to the R prompt. So if we go back to our console, we see that actually our, our commands have been entered. And R was able to construct a box plot by using the numerical variables W and Y. Okay, so this is how we use the, the editor window. Uh, we can also save our editor window, save our commands for future use. And so here I will maximize my window go to the RGUI file and then I'll, I'll press on save as and so here I can save on my, my machine anywhere that I want so here I'll put it in my, my documents folder and then I have an example will be the name of my file and we will use extension dot R and so now I can recall these commands for future use. Okay, and so that's it. This is how we use the R editor window. I hope you have a good day.